Welcome back to the Crypto 618 channel and in today's video we're going to take a look at Evil Pepe. So it's just another meme coin, uh, so many of them launching uh, these days. But this one's pretty cool, this one's like uh, Evil. So <laughs> I'll show you the graphics on the website in a minute so it's pretty cool. So this one here, um, the main uh, feature they've got is for bets and gaming. So if you're into bets and gaming, uh, they've got an uh, app that they're bringing out in a couple of weeks uh, of launch, so that's pretty good. They have very low taxes and they've got the listings organized as well as some central exchange listings as well. So that's pretty good. Renounce contract, that's what their plan is. So let's have a quick look at this. Now we've only got less than 10 hours left before the pre-sale finishes and then uh, it will be going live after that. Now at the moment it is oversubscribed by about five times. 118 BNBs went in it. They only wanted to raise about 20 BNB. Uh, but it's it's actually done really well. So if we go down and have a quick look at the token met, token metrics, you can see that 35% for pre-sale. We got 16, 17% like for liquidity. Uh, we've got the for the betting and gaming, the putting side 10%, staking 5%, and then there's two centralized exchanges, which is like one to two, three percent, uh, and then the burning about 28%. And everything is locked up, uh, which is really good. So you've got the liquidity locked up. It's automatically, once the pre sales over, that goes straight uh, into a lockup. So it's pretty cool. Uh, so yeah, and the most important thing here, you've got the audit, KYC, and the doxed. A lot of the projects don't have these badges. Uh, I like to look at ones that do have the badges. They've made a little bit more effort, and there's a very good chance that they won't rug. If they don't have any badges whatsoever, it's highly possible that they will rug. There's nothing stopping them from doing that. However, this project, uh, they've got all these boxes ticked, so that's pretty good. All right, let's have a look uh, at the website. Check it out. It's pretty cool. We've got some great graphics here. And um, as you can see, this community run ca uh, meme coin, and they want to destroy all the other Peppy uh, coins to become the one true meme. So that's a, a bit of fun on that. So that what they do is there's going to be 15 um, chances out of 100. Every 100 bets, uh, 2.5k in tokens will be burned automatically. And also they've got auto burn deflationary contract. So that's pretty good. So it's it's really to do what's happening is it's deflationary. Okay, that's fine. I think 1% is going to deflationary. But what happens is part of every um, transaction, they put that into this games and lottery. And that's where it's then uh, where you can bet and actually win it. So that's pretty good. I think it's an interesting functionality. In I haven't seen it done this way before, so that's pretty good. Another interesting thing that they do is they can change, not the contract name, but the actual name of the app or the DAP that they're going to have. So they're going to be able to theme it out. Uh, the Christmas, Easter, and Japan New Year, for example, there. So that's pretty good. Uh, I haven't seen that done before. You can see one year locked, uh, one billion supply, 28% burned. And when you do sell, there's 6% on the marketing, 3% that goes towards the bet, and 1% auto burn, which is pretty good. Uh, phase one, launch website, audit and KYC, uh, pre sale and pink sale, launch and get your listings. And then they want to be able to basically get the um, DAP up and running for the betting side in the next few weeks. And after that, they want to go for a Certec audit uh, and, and getting their listings on another central exchange. A couple of team members there, so that's pretty good. Uh, you can check out the audit. I had a quick look at the white paper. It's pretty brief, doesn't say too much, pretty much says what's uh, on the website. They do talk about staking uh, in there as well, so not too much on that one. We have a look at uh, Twitter. They've been very active. I think 41 tweets uh, since they started there. I mean, they're pretty active. They've got a few people retweeting them already. Uh, they got Docs Devs, Renounced Contract, 1% Buy Tax, and I think 10% Sell Tax. Uh, no Team Tokens, and they're coming up with a betting app. So that's pretty good. You can see how they're running competitions already. Uh, they do have a Telegram group. Uh, you can see here that there's some more giveaways. Uh, so it's really good. They've, they're getting a few things going already. Obviously, they know how to market it, which is why uh, so much has come into the uh, pre-sale. So I think, uh, yeah, check that out. It's it's worthwhile. Uh, I think over here, if we go over to Dexview, you see no data yet because it's still in pre-sale. But this is where all the um, information is going to come in the chart as soon as uh, it becomes live. You'll see all this information start to come through, and you'll see all that the t token holders uh, 
you know, be more and more token holders here. So this is where you'll be able to see it. Uh, I think, yeah, so it's pretty good. I think that's uh, all I have for you today. If you do want to get uh, into the Evil Pepe, I will drop my link in the comments below in the description. So you can check that out. Uh, and just remember there's less than 10 hours uh, from this video uh, out now. So it won't be very long and it will be over. And then, um, then that'll be gone. So it'll be, if you do miss it, you can buy it afterwards on Pancake Swap. Just make sure you go to the website and get the correct contracts when you're searching on Pancakes Up. I think that's all I have for you today. Uh, don't forget, if you do like this video, hit the like button and subscribe if you like to see more of these videos. And I will talk to you guys soon. Thanks, guys. Bye.